under the pressure. Yeah. Yeah. Well, uh, out comes Chris MD, of course, with Scotty Pollock, who's a real key player in the game. He's going to be in the second. Scotty Pollock was named, you know, the next big thing for Hashtag United, and Seb even said himself, he reckons he's got the potential to go all the way. All right, so 32 minutes been played, coming as a sub, hoping to make an impact. I'm on the right wing. It's currently 1-0 in the game. Ryan Adams with the opener, and then shortly after, Jeremy Lynch scores to be fair, pretty good penalty. Uh, it's pretty even in the game so far, so hopefully I can come on and make an impact. Alright, so first real involvement in the game, uh, Jimmy plays a pass into Sam, he plays out wide to me, I've got a bit of space, I managed to just cut in, cut in last second, nearly sent him on the floor, play a nice little one-two with Dan, I'm through on goal, it's my big moment at Wembley, and then, yeah, big Emerald Heskey, comes in, big hand, coming on my shoulder, I don't, know, I don't know if it was a foul or not, but to be fair, if it was anyone else, I might have been alright, but when you look back at it, Heskey is absolutely rapid. He's done me for pace. Sort of dragged me back, but I'm already I'm already like leaning back. But yeah, I was gonna put it bottom left, and yeah, I just sort of off balance. So in the end, it just goes straight to David James. All right, so next, I've got a corner on the right side, 43rd minute. Whipped it in. Emil Heskey, luckily he's there to clear it away. Jared tries to flick it on, Sam's got possession, I'm calling through, I've got loads of space on the right, I get it, little step over, drop on the shoulder, ne nearly fell over again, and then yeah, who else but Dan Brown, top goal scorer, hashtag United, of course he's got, of course he's got to score at Wembley, but David James probably, probably could have done a lot better there, per se, I'll take it as an assist, but... It was pretty lucky to be there. Angels and demons out on that pitch, but Dan Brown, he's one of the angels. And I'm loving angels instead. It's a literature joke. <laughs> Scotty Pollock had a lot to do with that there, though, didn't he? Mate, Pollock would be class. Pollock's had a bigger influence on the game than Jared. So yeah, just, that's just what we need before half time. Two one up. So yeah, things are looking good. All right, so Jacko with a goal kick. Jack Harrison flicks it on. Dan Brown tries to play it over to the right wing. Managed to beat Sean Garnier in the air. Play a pretty, pretty bad pass, to be honest. So Dan Brown collects it, plays it into Theo Baker, and that's what Theo did. That was it again. 3 1 hashtag, and yeah, he's going crazy, he loves it. Right, so corner on the right side, play a little one-two with Dan. A bit of a hospital pass to Theo, but he managed to get shot, blocked, and then on his left foot, Theo does what he does best, scoring at Wembley, making him top top goal scorer in Wembley. And yeah, four one hashtag. Can't really claim it as my assist, so it did get blocked, but yeah, nice little link up, me and Dan, and then Theo obviously finished it. A little taken off guard there, wasn't it? Sometimes you've just got to unleash the Hell. beast when the keeper isn't expecting it and, and Hughes actually he's walking towards the touchline as if he's had enough I don't know if that's a, his choice or the manager uh, Gallus plays me through I let it run uh, he's running at Josh Peters I was going to play it over to Charlie and then I cut back I managed to send him on the floor nice little one two with Robbie Fowler and yeah it was pretty good defending tracking back in the end but yeah that would have been that would have been a pretty nice goal all right so Seb's got it on the left side plays a lovely ball to charlie running at david james david james comes out managed to foul him charlie sort of does a little roll on the side and then obviously finishes it which is an unbelievable goal to be fair he's done it charlie morley for david james to the crow surely david james will still receive a card for that so pretty much straight after that goal, we get possession, Gallus plays it over, cuts back, pass it into Jamel, he plays it again to me, Robbie Savage is looking in for it in the middle, I cut back again, play it into Robbie Savage, nice nice football to be fair, play it back to Jamel, plays it to Gallas, to Robbie, and you know, to Rich, Rich plays it up there, if only if only this didn't touch uh, Tekka's Town Flair, because we get it again, Robbie Savage, plays it into Morley, Nice ball over to me. Heavy touch to be fair, and then square it to Phil Martin. Great finish, and that's 6 1. And of course, it's our man, Phil Martin, with the goal. The unforgettable Martin, and there goes the music again. If you haven't already Who's gone. Who's pressing that button? 
I'm going to shout at those flames near to me, because I tell you what, I need some warming up. It's certainly interesting how there, that was... Um, was that, was that a question of offside? No, Phil Martin. Phil Spotter. What's the question of offside? He passed it by And that was Pollock with the assist again, mate. I'm not being funny, but Pollock... Uh, now I see why everyone's calling them the next big thing. Right, so that's most of the main individual highlights. And yeah, I just want to say thank you to everyone involved with EE, Wembley, and obviously Spencer and Seb and everyone at the club who's made this happen. I want to thank everyone, all the fans that came to visit. There was about 34,000 people in the end who raised loads of money for charity. So it was, it was an amazing day. Yeah, just want to say thank you to everyone that voted for me for Man of the Match. It was close in the end, 2% off Theo, but yeah, thank you to everyone that voted for me. So yeah, if you did enjoy the video, give it a like, comment down below, subscribe, and yeah, don't forget to hashtag.